Welcome to the introduction to EndNote presentation. In this part, we will learn how to switch between EndNote's search modes. EndNote's search modes are here to help facilitate your online searches you conduct through EndNote. There are three, the integrated mode, the local library mode, and the online search mode. The online search mode allows you to search articles online without importing them immediately to your library on your computer. The local library displays only the articles saved on your library, which is saved on your computer. Lastly, the integrated mode is both the previous modes combined. It's generally not a good idea to search articles using the integrated mode. For example, we'd like to search PubMed for articles through EndNote. First, click on the globe icon here, which is the online mode. The online search mode results are shown in a temporary view here. Let's conduct a quick search on PubMed. So under online search, click on PubMed. Now click on the search tab, which is already here. Enter certain search terms. Let's with HIV and year 2012 and author a Smith search. You can see here there are 113 articles and we can tr retrieve them all from 1 to 113 if we'd like. So while we wait for PubMed to import in this temporary file all of the articles that it searched, we can choose articles here to read very briefly the abstract that was found on PubMed. Once we find some articles that we'd like, we can select them and you can press Control to click on more than one article at a time. For example, we'd like to keep these four articles and move them into our local library. Once you clicked on all of the articles that you'd like, right click, select Copy References To, and you can choose my EndNote library here. Those have been saved directly onto your local library. And you can check here that we had four articles at first, five articles because we added one manually, and now we copied four new references from our search onto our local library here. If we go back to this mode, we can still search for even more articles if we'd like and read their abstracts and select them to put in our library.